Arcade in the USA, Rhode Island. Welcome to the Pokemon Pokedex. It's a podcast all about Pokemon, so let's get ready to catch them all. Hey everyone, I'm Felicity, Reese's little sister, the cooler half of this podcast duo. <laughs> and I'm Reese, truly Pokemon loving half. Felicity, you think you're cooler just because you beat me at Pokemon Go yesterday? Obviously. But I admit, you know more about the Pokedex than anyone I know, so I guess you're pretty cool too. Well, not everything. There's a few more I don't know about. But before, we wanted to thank you for coming to s- listen to this podcast again. We have done six episodes so far, and we're on a roll. We're really excited that one of you already sent us a voicemail, and I'm really happy about that. Well, Sidney, what would you like to say? Well, I just want to shank- thank all you guys for hearing these episodes, and we're going to make more if you listen more. Before we start today's Pokemon adventure, did you know that our family is like a podcasting machine, am I right? Yeah. That's right. We get podcasters, podcasts, everything from Harry Potter and Percy Jackson. And our parents, well, they talk about trends like House of the Dragon, Rings of Power, Outland, or Bridgerton. You name it, stuff we're totally not allowed to watch yet. <laughs> yeah, but maybe when we're like 30. Anyway, you can check all that out on MiriamLake.com. But today is all about Pokemon! So, you ready, Reese? Alright, everyone, let's get out these Pokedexes! <laughs> Talk about my favorite Pokemon of all time, Charizard, Charizard, Charizard. It's number six in Pokedex and has some serious firepower. It's like a nuclear bomb. Charizard is spelled C H A R I Z A R D. Guess what? It's basically a dragon. You can, you know, like those fire breathing lizards live in castles and stuff? That's Charizard. You forgot the wings and the flame tail. <laughs> Charger is a fire and flying type with the ability Blaze, which makes his fire attacks even stronger when it's at low health. Like when you're playing video games and you suddenly get superpowers and you're almost out of lives. <laughs> I've done that sometimes. It's really rare. Except this superpower is like shooting massive fireballs at anything your way. Charizard attacks include Fire Blast, Dragon Claw, Flamethrower, and just to name a few, the signature moves are Fire Spin and Flare Blitz, which are cool as they sound. A blitz is basically like a football move you when you like try to tackle someone. Yeah, it's just with fire. Picture Charger just with like, wearing a football helmet and just charging another random Pokemon with fire. <laughs> that's, well, that's Flare Blitz. And Fire Spin, just a tornado of fire. Yeah, just a big tornado. Just imagine that. It's just... Charizard, Charizard can't evolve, but if you, it can mega evolve into Mega Charizard X or Y with the certain stones. Mega Charizard X is black and blue with super strong dragon powers, with a wingspan stretching up to ten feet. And Mega Charizard Y, well, it's like Charizard but even more epic, which is possible. It's basically better than normal Charizard for me. It just looks sick. The wings stretching to twenty feet. Even though Charizard's awesome, it got some neat weaknesses. It's not a fan of electric, ground, water, water, rock type roots, the usual. So if you got Pikachu, Charizard might be in a bit of trouble. It's a mouse, Felicity. A dragon could crush a mouse. Fire Blast would one-shot Pikachu, especially Ash's Pikachu. Charizard about 5 feet and 3 inches tall. And it weighs about 200 pounds. That's a whopper for you. That's like a dragon and a super buff weightlifter had a baby. Reese, what does Charizard remind you of? Hmm, to me, everyone's like it. Charizard's like the most majestic, powerful dragon that could be the king of all dragons. It is like a hero in a fantasy story, but a dragon, which is not evil. Everyone (laughs) loves it. That's so for you. For me, Charizard is a giant fiery orange that's so spicy, it could set the world on fire? 
Ding, ding. Fun fact time. Did you know Charizard's wings could carry it up four, 445 feet and 613 feet in the air? That's, and it's fire so hot it can melt boulders. Talk about lava. It's that's, super high. That's like hotter than the hottest sauce ever. Charizard is the Cantor region, but sometimes hanging out in Gala region, too, because even dra- dragons like to travel. You can notice that it lives in the Gala region from Leon's Charizard. Well, there you have it. Those are some fun facts about Pokemon the Charizard. If you missed any, let us know. We love hearing from you. In future episodes, we'd love to hear on your voice on the poke- podcast. Podcast. Send us your feedback, and maybe we can play it on the show. Just head to <laughs> just head to maryblake.com. Click on contact us in the right upper hand corner, and leave us a voicemail. Don't forget to start telling us our first name, where you're from, and what your favorite Pokemon is. We can't wait to hear from you. All right, everyone, it's time for the joke of the day. What is Charizard's favorite insect? I have a guess, but I don't think it's right. Is it fireflies? Okay, that's funny, Felicity. I get why Charizard would love fireflies. They're burning hot in the butt, but they're not so tasty. Charizard, please stay with us or you'll get allergies. (laughs) Oh my gosh. Thanks so much for turning in today's Pokemon Pokedex episode. We hope you enjoyed as much fun listening as we made it. Don't forget to subscribe, lend in your feedback, and maybe leave us a joke of your own. You can email our parents at maryandblakemediagmail.com. Or go to maryandblake.com, click contact us, and leave a voicemail. We'd love to hear from you. I'm Felicity. And one more time, I'm Reese. Now go, go catch them, them all!